world in 2004. A shift of world powers. The world is too small to feed us all. Energy resources are exhausted. The climate has changed and our environment is destroyed. And all this has resulted in worldwide conflicts leading to the world's end. But don't we underestimate our own adaptive capabilities? Behavioral adaptation and technology will be our tools to prevent the world of going to its end. Then what is our perspective on the world of 2040? And how does this relate to the chemicals industry in northwestern Europe? The industry will develop into operations on a smaller scale, which means that feedstock change will be shorter. Production processes will be highly specialized yet flexible, enabling stakeholders to switch from one chain to another. Added value will become more important than the number of units sold. But how does the world get there? What we need are the right starting conditions, which can be met when focusing on the following three themes. Knowledge, the one non-exploitable and ever sustainable resource. Synergy, guided cooperations between small and large companies and industries facilitated by extensive infrastructure. Diversity, mixing backgrounds on intra- and inter-corporate relations drives innovation. Next question is, what does this imply for the industry on factory level? 